I'm gonna do a tutorial on a smoked rib roast to be froast. Let's go start the grill. I am gonna use my Pro 780. I've got my Jackery powered up. Press the button. So easy to start. I'm gonna go for 225. Push that again. Push to ignite and it's igniting. While the grill's heating up, let's uh, get her flavored. So I'm just using vegetable oil. Just gonna be generous on it all around. Yes, that's Rhonda not using gloves. Just using the vegetable oil as a binder. You can use anything you want. I'm gonna use Neil Serap's Tasty Bark as my flavoring. It has a little bit of rosemary in it as well, which I really like on beef. Get all sides. I'm gonna smoke this low and slow. I'm hoping to get a beautiful smoke ring on it. You can do it in your oven. You can do it anywhere, really. You can do it on your gas grill. I am using my Traeger smoker today. Hoping for that smoke ring. <laughs> I'm gonna add some thyme and rosemary from my garden. It's not a very big roast, so it's not gonna fit into well. Maybe I'll just tie that. I'm gonna poke some holes and get some garlic in there. I'm just gonna use my Dell Strong cutlery knife. That's all I need. They're so sharp. Just put a little hole. Stuff the garlic in. The hole. Stuff the garlic in. Good. That'll look really nice in my photo when I'm done. Uh, that's kind of off, isn't it? Maybe one over here. There we go. So my roast is ready. I am going to insert my meter plus. It's amazing. I have a discount code. Um, just a girl. It's in my Instagram. The link is in my Instagram or just go and use just a girl. It's amazing. I use it for every single cook that I do. While my grill is heating up, I have a pan that I'm going to do my roast on. I have two packages of beef oxo down there. I was out of beef broth, which is really weird. And my homemade stuff is frozen. I am gonna put a little bit more of the Neil Serap in the bottom. I have the kettle boiling. So I'm gonna put like, not hot water, but I'm gonna get it pretty good up there um, so that it's already warm and let's get it on the grill. And there we have two and a half cups. Oops, except the half one on the table. I don't know why it's not pouring. Hmm. There we go. And we're up to temperature. Let's get her in. Of course it started to rain because I started the grill, right? been in there almost two hours and she's looking pretty good I waited um, about two hours and the rub was set so I started spritzing it spritzing it with um, beef broth and Leon Perrins she's looking pretty and we are four hours in that color is just coming along so nice. We are to temperature. I am going to pull that beauty off of here. I brought it to 150. 